Hey guys, I want to do a little video here on a Cut Tech joiner. I looked at a bunch of different joiners. I looked at Delta. I looked at several ones, um, but I just couldn't come to the conclusion that I liked them by the reviews that I read. You can't always trust all reviews, but I will say this Cut Tech right here. I bought this. You can go online and pull that up. Um, it's another name. It's under another name. This company in Tennessee sells these um, Cut Techs, and they're very good um, joiners. I've used this one several times already. You have the lock right here, and you have the place here where you can raise it. This is a quarter inch that it'll go up to, if I'm not mistaken. And um, you have to set it up. You got four screws on each one of these platforms. You need to use a level. And I set this one up. It took me a little while, but it's pretty simple to put together. You just want this um, blade in here barely touching. And I really do like it. And this is a six inch one. I was going to buy the eight, but I thought six would be a plenty. But I'm going to just run it and show it to you. But it's called Cut Tech. And to me, it's probably about as good as anything you're going to get because it's got great reviews on it. And I just want to do a review on this one here, and I'll show you a little more. Um, I'm going to run this piece of wood. This is kind of rough right here, but this thing will smooth it right up. I got this one set where I ha don't have to move it, where it just will take off maybe just a, I don't know if it's a sixteenth or whatever, but it don't it don't take much. But here we go. Here, let's try this thing out. <laughs> That really smoothed that up right there. It took off of that rough stuff. And uh, I just ran this piece through there. And um, it smoothed it up real well. I'm building a table right now. And I'm going to run this piece through there. You can see that. Right up. I really like it. That's all I need right there. If I'm building a table, like I said, and here's another one that looks pretty rough. Uh, hopefully the knot don't come out. Alright, that's pretty good. That was deeper, but that's all I need for what I'm doing. I ain't worried about this side. And, uh, so that's the cut tech. And hopefully I can show you. Hang on just a second there. I'll show you a closer up look. Um, the the eight inch ones have these little things that pull out on the side where you can put a longer board. But you could run a five six five six foot board through here and do well. And uh, but I do like this cut tech. And you can adjust this, put it at an angle here on this side piece. Um, it's got adjustments on it, and um, I'll let you see the back side of it. But I will say this. I, I don't, I'm just doing this. Hey, the company's good. I called him up. I think I talked to either Mark or Mike. I can't remember. He works there, but real nice people. And um, But this is called the Cut Tech. Hope you enjoyed this video, and it does real well on planing a board flat, too. But I don't have anything that I need to plane flat today. And uh, But the joiner called Cut Tech. And they got some new ones that they just come out with, too. You might want to check out their company. It starts with a W, and I can't pronounce that name right now. And I should have had it. But if you pull up Cut Tech Joiners, it'll take you to that website. You may have to look for it, but you will find that website. God bless. Hope you have a happy new year. Thanks for looking. And um, be back to see you again. This is a t Tech Outdoors. If you will, subscribe to us and give us a like. Uh, but if you're looking for a good joiner, I believe this is all you'll need just for a man that, you know, um, that's just basically doing small stuff, but this thing here has spiral blades on it too As you can see the blades down in here. It ain't on right now But it's got a spiral cut and it doesn't leave waves in it, but it does give you a good clean cut over and out. Have a good one. God bless